Okay guys, so I'm going to do a quick video just uh, updating you on some of the uh, highlights of the hatchlings that we have so far. Um, some of the ones you've already seen that have gotten a little bigger. Um, just some neat stuff we've got hanging around here. Come on, buddy. Lavender radar. We've had a really, really good year with lavender radars, and we're probably going to be able to release a little bit more than we'd like. Um, sad to say, uh, my good friend Paul Allen down at Bright Albino, he is uh, no longer in it, which most of you probably already know. Um, he's taken a hiatus for how long, I don't know. Uh, we'll miss you, Paul. Um, but we're going to keep the lavender bells and the bright bells strong. We do have a lot of Paul's projects here, including the black bells. So just a little side note, we'll miss you, Paul, if you're watching this, and, uh, you know, We'll see, see you at some point. Keep in touch. Anyways, let's keep going with our, our uh, babies. We got some really neat Halloween mask bold stripe. These guys don't get the Halloween mask till they're a little bit larger. So many babies this year. I'm trying to remember. Oh, this is a red stripe that hatched uh, about a week ago. Finally got some stuff from our Inferno Red Stripe group. So we'll hopefully be releasing some of them yet this year. Uh, right, white and yellow Raptors. We got two of those. So, yes, we do carry white and yellows here. Uh, they are real white and yellows. Um, <clears throat> we work with Jamie at Razor Sharp with our white and yellow stuff. We both have a large assortment of that. I'm trying to find a certain clutch. We got too many here. These are neat hatchlings from our Lavender Eclipse project. They get real, real light looking, almost snow looking. Neat looking babies. G Project Raptor, G Project uh, Partial Reverse Stripe. For a certain one. Or G Project. Uh, gem, gem Bell, Lavender Gem stuff. Here's a regular gem. And hold on, I'm gonna back up here a bit, Sean. He's hiding. Come on, buddy. This is a gem lavender radar. I know. He's got snake eyes, really neat looking animals. Really, really ghostly pink. This is a G Project Eclipse, also known as an Atomic Eclipse. Reverse stripe from that. I know. Looking for a certain one. Here's some more G Project stuff. Another Eclipse. <clears throat> Next, I want to show you something pretty cool. That's tangible. G Project. Alright. So, this is basically a clutch from the Sunsets. This is re really dark. I'm going to show you the difference. These, this sunset, if he comes off, actually it's not a sunset. I apologize. It's a blizzard hat. See how he's really dark, <clears throat> normal blizzard looking? Now this one, this is a sunset. See the difference in the yellow in his back? That's, this, this will get more and more intense as it gets older. Uh, you can definitely see the difference in these two animals. Just literally hatched about an hour ago. One's really dark. One's got the yellow back. We'll give you updates as they get a little bit larger. Now this one I'm extremely excited about, and uh, I had to thank Kelly from Hiss. Um, she sent us an Emmerine Las Vegas possibly het typhoon male, which is stunning. We showed you plenty of pictures of them. Uh, we finally got the first clutch out, and we hatched a Emmerine. Let me get better light in here. Emmerine Las Vegas typhoon. That's one of the most colorful typhoons I think I've ever seen. <clears throat> the carroting is insane already. He ain't gonna stay still. Just an amazing looking animal. 
Uh, I'll be honest, I wasn't a big Typhoon fan because the colors, uh, you know, really, you know, it's actually, it's clutch paint, they striped Emery in Las Vegas. The colors weren't as uh, bright as some of the radar stuff and, and the others, but uh, there's a lot of life in this project. Now that we get the Emerine stuff in there, it's amazing looking color. Uh, let's come on down here, we'll show you some updates to some of the bigger ones. Oh. much stuff or not enough depends how you look at it that's just some bright bells that are growing up <clears throat> it's a uh, raptor white and yellow a little bit bigger This is a neat little uh, pure patternless got from my friend Dave over at Dave's Fine Geckos. It's growing pretty well. Neat little dark color to it. <clears throat> this is a really neat marble die. You can see it's got the crazy head pattern going on. Really white and trickled orange. Full marble die animal. Apologize if I'm going fast, but there's just so much to show you. And not enough tape on the uh, video. That's a really crazy looking Eclipse G project, atomic whatever G you want to call it, uh, many names, whatever you call them, they are awesome looking. Probably my favorite uh, eclipses that you'll find uh, by far. Okay. Here's an update of that little sunrise that we hatched a couple weeks ago. You can see they just have a total different look to them. Almost like a ghostly look, and they're going to get a lot more yellow as they get older. Nice red striped bell. These guys have already started getting to the point we start uh, taking their clutch mate out and splitting them up and giving them more room. Inferno growing up. Show you just a couple more here. Really nice red stripe again. Well, you know, I could sit here for a, sit here a lot longer and show you, but uh, what else we got here? I'm just gonna show you a couple more. If I can find the one in here. There it is. Neat little Las Vegas. Looks pretty normal now, but there's some secrets to that one which we'll we'll tell you later. And last but not least, we'll end the video with two little marbled eyes that just hatched yesterday two full marbled eyes neat little animals i love how these things grow and the marble and the eyes start cracking up so we're keeping busy here hatching every day i'll try to keep you guys updated if there's something in particular you'd like to see in certain morphs uh, also keep on the lookout we are going to be launching a brand new website uh, thank you from gecko babies brandon at gecko babies uh, helping me build the new one um, that will hopefully be coming at the end of May, beginning of June, uh, where we can put a lot of babies on there for you. So let us know if there's something in particular you want to see so we can focus some of these videos on certain projects. If not, we're just going to keep showing you random stuff. So take care, guys. Hope you're having a good season.